prove that uh, integral 0 to infinity sin x upon x dx is equal to pi upon 2 consider the you know solution consider the integral mm, integral over c e raised to power i to z over z dz is equal to integral over c f of z dz uh, here c is a contour consisting of uh, real x is uh, rho to r where r rho is small and r is large rho to r mm, and second uh, the upper half of circle where z is equal to r upper half circle where modulus z is equal to r real x is of uh, minus r to r real x is minus r to r and upper half circle with gamma modulus z is equal to rho upper half circle with gamma modulus z is equal to rho since there is no singularity within the C so Cauchy's uh, residue theorem we have integral over C over f of z ds z is equal to r to r uh, uh, rho to r f of x dx plus integral over um, factorial f of z dz this portion plus integral over minus r to r uh, minus r to minus rho f of x dx plus uh, integral over gamma f of z dz is equal to 0 equation 1 now by the Jordan lemma we have uh, limit uh, r tends to infinity integral over factorial f of z dz this one term is equal to 0 since uh, limit uh, z tend to 0 z f of z is equal to 1 now putting z is equal to rho e raised to r, r to theta so integral over gamma f of z dz is equal to integral pi to 0 e raised to power eta rho e eta theta over rho e raised to power eta theta into rho eta e raised to power eta theta d theta is equal to integral pi to 0 e raised to power eta rho cos of theta plus sine of theta upon rho e raised to power eta theta into rho eta e raised to power eta theta d theta which is equal to eta integral over pi to 0 e raised to power eta rho cos of theta plus eta sine theta d theta therefore from limit rho tends to 0 r in, uh, integral over rho tends to 0 integral over gamma f of z dz is equal to limit uh, integral limit uh, tends to 0 eta integral over pi to 0 e raised to power eta rho cos of theta sin theta d theta is equal to eta integral over pi to 0 d theta is equal to minus pi eta hence as rho tends to 0 r tends to infinity we get uh, from 1 integral 0 to infinity f of x dx from this equation f of x uh, dx uh, plus uh, integral minus infinity to 0 f of x dx minus pi eta is equal to 0 so uh, or integral minus infinity to infinity f of x dx is equal to pi eta or integral minus infinity to infinity e raised to power eta x upon x dx pi eta equating the imaginary parts of the both sides we get integral minus infinity to infinity sin x upon x dx is pi or integral minus infinity to infinity sin x upon x dx is pi upon 2